Hello folks, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of World of Tanks. Today we're playing with AMX M451, so French tier 9 heavy tank. You all know that we have a top of the tree this month, so we all aim for AMX M454, with which we're gonna have an episode in the next couple of days. So let's first speak about this tank. Smaller gun, better gun if you ask me. 400 alpha, 9 seconds of gun loading, 1.83 aiming time and 0.31 dispersion at 100 meters. This gun looks pretty damn good on the paper and it it's like that when you're using it. If you compare it with this one, 0.36 dispersion at 100 meters and 2.5 aiming time, yes this is 470 alpha damage but less penetration values and gun is far from being accurate so me personally i prefer this one but we'll have uh, one game with this gun and the other game with the bigger gun equipment i'm using please just a small advice for every single one of you if you choose to use bigger gun put something else instead of turbo here i know you're going to be slow but better to improve your gun handling than to you know stress yourself because you're gonna miss you're gonna miss a lot let's jump into our battlefield and let's see what this tank can bring to us i didn't play that many battles with it but i'm kind of satisfied yeah i don't have Nothing special when it's about the results with this tank until now. But I hope that after I give it a go and play like 20 battles in a row or something, I'm going to have something of which I'm going to be proud, you know. For now, I think that, I don't know, I would be satisfied if I have like a close to 4k damage or combined, never mind. I just want to be useful, not useless, and especially when I'm top tier, as I'm right now. Immediately we're going heavy flank. I maybe forgot to mention this tank has uh, eight minus 8 degrees of gun depression, so you can be pretty successful when you're working over ridge lines, but uh, don't forget that whenever you're trying to do something like this, peaking over ridges and everything, you can see how Cola and this tank all in all is huge so you're gonna be shredded apart from every single side of yours because yeah huge tank so you need to be really careful let's hope that <laughs> I wanted to say let's go and let's hope we're gonna have a nice battle and immediately our light decided to suicide so yep middle is Lost, or oh, we'll see. Probably they'll try to create something like crossfire because you can see here that all of the couple. Eh, this is the difference between minus eight and minus ten. You can work with it but you can't do that look you can't do that perfectly so not that bad start i'm bouncing something i'm hitting my shots so Soon we'll have crossfire. Tier 9 British destroyer gonna try to do something. Ah, oh, that was a bad shot. That was a bad shot by me, and unfortunately. Unfortunately, we're not doing as we would like Let's 
Okay, I'm gonna be penetrated. Not good. He's dead. Somehow, maybe we'll be able to survive this. I guess it depends a lot of our friend behind us. So we'll find out what's gonna happen. 2.6k already 600 I assisted for pretty damn good pretty damn good uh, DPM when it's about this small gun and yeah you can see that my friend <laughs> and me we're kind of uh, Shredding apart our enemies, maybe we'll be able to. Maybe we'll be able to shred them apart till the end. So let's see. And yeah, that's kind of the case. So, what's the best choice for me here? Because I'm almost full HP. Which is pretty damn good, I would say. Let's try go to the middle. Because if I can somehow. Yes. I guess I can. Good that I didn't stuck here. As you could see, I didn't use neither one premium shell which is maybe <clears throat> gonna be something i need for this oh no he's with small gun i guess i guess we'll take a couple of more hit points from this guy and maybe be closer to five or six k uh, this is bad approach this is pretty bad approach but if we come from this position here, it's gonna be better. Yeah. One by one by one by one. And we are packing some damage. 230. Well. Yeah. His DPM is far better than mine this guy is aiming for for me but oh well I'm sorry my friend I'm sorry my friend I'm seeing that you're struggling but all of us were struggling from time to time <clears throat> One more shot, or my friend's gonna finish that. This was actually pretty damn nice game. 5.89k damage, something I assisted for. 2.8, I blocked. Four kills. This may be an ace tanker as well. Let's see. I'm not sure, but it's pretty possible. No, first class. So yeah, you can see how good this tank actually is. And a lot, of course, a lot of players are playing with this tank nowadays because of the uh, top of the tree. So let's see. This was a carry or, well, yeah, kind of a good carry with four kills, 1.4k base XP. Nice stuff. Nice stuff. We didn't shoot gold, so we even earned something. But okay, we had some mission here. We finished. Eh, ladies and gentlemen, that was... Um, that was a small gun. <laughs> right now we're gonna try to do something similar with with big gun. But once again, I told you, if you choose to use this bigger gun, like all the time, please do something about third slot. I'm just showing you how this gun is functioning. I don't wanna uh, remove my turbo because I already kind of get used to playing this tank so I don't want to 
be slow as a turtle. This tank with the, especially when you're playing against tier tens, lower penetration values, shell velocity 800 meters per second for both shells, even premium shells, but yeah, 270. We're gonna choose immediately because against tier tens, don't expect you're gonna you're gonna shine. One more thing, this gun low rolls pretty often, believe me. So sometimes I had bigger rolls uh, with that smaller gun than I had with this one. So I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. So yeah, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's just my experience. Maybe my experience is unique, but yeah, I'm not sure about that. Really, I'm not. No, 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 no. Huh. Never mind, I'm trying to avoid it. Yeah, one more, one more pretty interesting thing. Whenever you're trying to side scrape with this tank, well, you're doing that wrong. Because almost all the time you're gonna get slapped on your side like I received this shot from oh Badger is here so we're we're happy we have 260 in front of us but on the other hand we are screwed we're screwed simple words What a bad aim that was. Let's see, can we do something? Once again, I'm aiming like a... I'm bouncing 60 TP side. Come on, punish him until... Am I gonna hit something in this game? Where that shell went was not even a bounce. Maybe someone was in front of T30, but I really doubt that. I really doubt. Let's see. Hmm? Interesting stuff is that somehow we're winning this game. And yep, enemy team is pretty damn uh, strong here. Luckily, I'm bouncing this. They're pretty strong here on this on this corner. I'm bouncing bouncing some side shots. Some I don't know. Once again, maybe I'm wrong, but maybe I'm wrong. But this this yeah, man, I'm gonna support you with this gun. You know how. You're not gonna be that happy about my support. Wow, I'm hitting side shot. That's something I should I should celebrate, I guess. Not intentionally, I clicked the right click, so it was kind of a auto aim. Once again, I'm I'm hitting. That's a good sign, right? And I'm killing Badger. Wow.
I'm really not expecting nothing, nothing special whenever I play with the big gun because I tried it a couple of times and it was oh, it was far from being good and far that I was far from being that I, I'm, I'm satisfied if you know what I mean I mean I, I think this is it would be a miracle if I if I would hit that so please folks consider avoiding this gun because you're not gonna feel you're not gonna feel happy and you're gonna have some white hairs on your head not just about penetration values not just about you know it's like a complete package so 800 of uh, 800 meters shell velocity with uh, even when you're shooting like premium ammunition it's fucking stupid if you know what i mean i don't think i can hit this but let's try eh? maybe once again no okay and yeah luckily for us we're winning this game so we're not gonna screw our Oop. guess not possible nope so not even 2k not even 1.5k okay a bit more than 2k combined but this is you know huge difference and believe me i can play 10 more games five games with smaller gun and five games with bigger gun every single time i'm gonna have better result with smaller gun see so never mind i i played against tier 10s believe me with smaller gun at least i would have i would have thousand more damage in this game in this type of a matchup actually it is like it is tank is good but only if you're using this gun because with this gun you're gonna pack damage with other gun you're gonna struggle and you're gonna you know have your uh, nerve breakdown and that's not something for which we're playing this game so folks i hope that you're gonna enjoy in your amx m451 and in your grind till our amx m454 i'm gonna take in i guess it depends on my silver but i guess in two days or something and then we're gonna check that tank and how that tank's functioning on our battlefields now nowadays because we all know that uh, how that tank was overpowered not that long ago they nerfed it and they nerfed it not just a bit and a lot of people from community community are saying that this tank is far from being that good nowadays but it's still playable so i guess we'll check that soon i hope that you that you're satisfied about my showcase of uh, my tier 9 amx m451 which i did today for you and i guess that you're you're actually happy at least about that first game which was pretty damn good i would say if you did please jump on those buttons and support my channel because that means a lot to me of course stay smiled and stay happy that's something most important nowadays and don't forget to snipe good kisses from alex and channel grind together see you these days on the battlefield folks stay good bye bye